Yes, madam. Hi, hello. Good morning to everyone. Uh, today we will discuss about such layout in Salesforce. Um, such layout, or we can exactly go through. Such layouts determine which fields are displayed and in what manner order of various such layouts. Uh, this means exactly if you are searching certain fields in Salesforce, uh, in what to get the result, the search fields. Uh, you can create such layouts for standard and custom objects. Uh, exactly, it will applicable both standard and custom objects. Uh, and also, you can uh, customize such layout for each unique user profiles uh, based on their requirements. And, and then customize such layout on a for object basis. Uh, what is edit such layout? And that means how we can go to uh, how we can uh, do this such layout in Salesforce Arc. I will show. Yeah, usually uh, when we go to a uh, uh, test object, this will show up on the test name. Uh, if you want to choose more fields, you can go for such layout. First, click on the setup. In the component box, you can uh, search in such layout. Uh, here we can see the objects, whatever available for this particular org. Uh, go through on the screen. Uh, here we can see all the objects, account, application, like. Uh, we can see lost the test object is there. We can open that test object. Uh, here we can see uh, all the profiles. Uh, example, uh, uh, you click on the system administrator. Uh, we will see how it works exactly. Uh, whatever you want, uh, this is, you can add it. At the same time, if you don't want, you can uh, remove it also. So you can add some fields. Uh, and also you can uh, segregate in a uh, order wise. So test is uh, up. So you can segregate in a uh, order wise also. And uh, um, but once if we added available fields to selected fields, uh, based on the order, it will display on the UI uh, in a similar way. Uh, like uh, test name, created date, uh, it is a sequence name, it, it will came in the UI. To save it. Yeah, here you can see the same sequential order come out from the uh, whenever we are uh, selected from the available fields like this uh, test name, created date, test. A record record ID email and such layout. Uh, that's how it it will work exactly in such layout. So we can copy one record and paste in global search. So we will get the result whatever we are searching like uh, test name create test uh, these are the uh, we can select it in a search layout so it will come oh. 
uh, this is all about the uh, edit uh, such layout. Uh, it uh, it represented these are the records which we are created manual for example purpose. Uh, like this. Uh, actually, madam, I have one doubt. Uh, so this structure will work for every object. For sir. Is this search layout will work for every object? Yeah, yeah, sir. It is available for every object. Uh, only this object is not available, sir. Uh, like a charter. Uh, Salesforce also not providing such layout for this object, sir. Our reports and the dashboards task event. I will show in our, sir. Okay, ma'am. It will support all the objects, sir. Only a uh, few objects is not supported. I will show. Okay, good boy. Of course. It will show in, throw an error, sir. We don't support such such as layout customers for this object. So, uh, Salesforce also not providing uh, such layout for these objects, sir. And, uh, points to remember uh, we can add up to 10 fields but control but sorry but cannot remove identifying fields such as account or case number and then field included in such layout uh, but is hidden from the field level security it won't be displayed thank you